Do you want to rehearse your answers one more time? No, Mom. It's fine. Okay. Then remember to shake their hands firmly, not... Like a pudding. Bravo! My gummy bear. This time you'll get it. 17 times a charm. Do your best. And remember, no matter what, Mommy's always here. Good luck. <laughs> so, Mr. Green, what makes you a good candidate for a company? Well, glad you ask, because I'm a quick learner. I like to think outside the box. I'm highly motivated and a self-starter. Although, I must admit, perfectionism is my greatest... Weakness. Weakness. basically legacy there. You know, hence the, the Goldilocks nickname. You know, most people think it's because of my hair. God, I was blonde as a kid. But actually, it's, it's much deeper. Anyways, insurance is my game. So I can confidently state that I'd be a good fit for this role because of my honesty, integrity, and reliability. Uh, thank you, Mr. Oldman. We'll let you know. Do I have time to go to the bathroom? Yes, but hurry. You're next. Mr. Green, you're up. Philip, nice to meet you. Allow me to give you a hard copy of my resume, gentlemen.
uh, it's all right, Mr. Green, our, our printed copy will work just fine. So, Mr. Green, what makes you think you'd be the ideal candidate for our insurance company? Honestly, sir, maybe I'm not. I came here making sure I had the right speech, the right hair, the right jacket, the right luck. And look at me. Things never go the way you want them to, do they? I guess that's why we have insurance. Genius. <laughs> what a piece of performance art, Mr. Green. The, the, the wig, the, the clothes, the fat face. The pigeon clue is a nice touch. Oh, personality like his will have our insurance policy selling like hotcakes. Danny, Rick, I think we've found the perfect salesman. Mom? Yes, Gummy Bear. I'm moving out. <laughs> <laughs>